It's on it now, buddy. So he's making what are you making? Biscuit. He's making brisket. And trust me, it's good. This is really good. He he has seasoning. Whatever he's making, whatever. His name is doing. He is peeling some onions. I'm going to my tutor, so he's gonna show you what he's gonna make. Alright, we're gonna try to season this brisket and put it in a crock pot with the baby. She woke up for my nap. Let's see if we can do this. Right, so we use these um, spices. Really good. Use these spices. Um, I really didn't measure, but I put them in this bowl, mix them together, and then we got the brisket there. I'm gonna season with salt and pepper um, on both sides, and then put that rub, I guess, on each side, and then put it in the crock pot. take the rest of that rub actually and I'm gonna put it in the crock pot over the onions we have onions um, about a cup of water and I had some chicken stock left over so I threw that in there um, and then we're gonna do it on low for eight hours nine hours and we're gonna see how it goes so that's the game plan we'll see how that goes you good she's still waking up it's all right but this is what it looks like in the crock pot so have it like there, all right? Um, so the fat side is up, whatever fat I left on, um, that side is up. So then once it renders down or whatever, it should make it nice. And then whatever drippings I have after, um, we'll use as like a sauce or something. So we'll see, this is the first time doing brisket. I don't have a smoker, so everything I, you know, I look at is it, like use a smoker or do a smoker with the paper so just don't have a smoker so um and then after the nine hours we're gonna put it in the oven put it on broil um and kind of crisp the top i want to put it on the grill but that might be kind of messy we'll see how tender it is i don't know if it's gonna fall apart but yeah we'll see how it goes all right so this is what we have after the crock pot for nine hours so next Four. up is Nine hours. Next step is we're gonna put some um, brown sugar on it and then stick it into the broiler for a couple minutes. They say that's how you get the crisp on it. As you can tell, we've already been picking at it. So far, it tastes pretty good. So this is what's left over of the onions and dripping. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna probably strain that and then put it in a container and just save it for uh, just to dip it in and keep it moist after it's all
taste test. Show me, tell me what you think, bro. Crispy and on the top. You like the crispy stuff? Came out pretty good, huh? Yeah. I ate the brown. And I ate the brown. Mommy, mm. just take her that whole piece. Just take that whole piece. No. Mm -hmm. One. Share that with your mom and your sister. Do not. JP. 